What's up, everybody? My name is Kareem Alon Crashy. This is uh, my first vlog, and um, yeah, I'm just uh, want to talk about some interesting things. This is pretty much a channel that is pretty much gonna be. I don't even know how to hold the camera right. <laughs> This is actually from my phone, but uh, yeah, this is actually gonna be a channel that is pretty much focusing on real estate, property management, maintenance, pretty much all around real estate and business. Um, because, you know, I live in New York City, I live in Queens, and uh, with the whole coronavirus thing going on, you know, things been very shaken up, you know, the markets, business everywhere it's uh it's chaos um and um <clears throat> you know thank the lord that you know we still generating some business and i'll get to that in a bit but for starters sorry for the i see apartment <laughs> yeah so uh wow this is very interesting i think i could hold this in a better way is it well yeah, I guess I'll do it that way. <laughs> so for starters, um, you know, I would say three, four months ago, I met my partner, Emil, <clears throat> at a job interview. Uh, I was working at a job as a property manager making six figures, you know, above. I wasn't happy. You know, I was just wasn't happy with the job, with my life, you know, trading, trading in my health into building other people's assets. And I just said to myself, look, I'm 28 years old. What am I doing? You know, do I really want to work for someone? You know, <clears throat> so I had a job interview with Emil and uh, he just told me, he's like, look, Kareem, uh, blah, 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 told me about the job position. It was literally $20 an hour, I turn it down. But he presented an idea to me. He said, look, I started this company um, you know, I'm looking for someone to work with, go to the, you know, to grow it to the next level and whatnot. So I told him, I said, I'll get back to you. And <clears throat> probably within a month, I probably got four job offers, six figures again, as a property manager. I said to myself, I said, why not jump to this opportunity that Emil presented to him? to me and why not you know why not build my own asset you know he offered me ownership and you know whatnot so you know i end up getting a percentage of the company um and that's how me and him became partners in the beginning i had no idea what I was doing as far I mean as far as like real estate property management construction yeah I have a background but how do I generate leads how do I get leads how do I get property managers to work with how do I get landlords to work with and <clears throat> funny enough that we had this app called networks so networks is pretty much just an app <clears throat> the contractors news and to get leads I was doing horrible I was calling these people I uh, was calling clients, regular Joe Schmoes, and they wouldn't pick up, they wouldn't write back. I was basically losing money the moment I started, and I'm like, holy shit, I don't think Emil is going to want to work with me. Um, and we just found a property manager named Ryan, which is a great friend. He just started giving us all these jobs. Um, the reason why he started giving us all these jobs because, you know, I found uh, contractors and I, you know, I will give them jobs nonstop. You know, Ryan will literally call me any time of the day. Hey, look, I need someone today. I'll find someone today. Um, please do it for a low price. I give it for a reasonable, uh, reasonable price. So that was a strategy that me and Emil was pretty much using, you know, um, you know, beating everyone's pricing, start with 24 seven, basically coverage, you know, we'll get calls two in the morning, I'll get somebody there four in the morning, um, and doing the managing, managing uh, contractors with the, with, the, with the tenants, setting up appointments, 
um, all this great stuff. And me and Emil just practically he became my brother. You know, we're brothers. I was in his wedding. Um, his wife is amazing. You know, his wife is like my sister. So we got really close. <clears throat> and uh, from there, you know, we was trying to basically start this, uh, you know, every in every company you need a spreadsheet, right? For for whatever reason, whether it's uh, pricing or how much you made or tenant information. Uh, me, me and Emil tried to do it and I just said to myself, I said to Emil, I said, look, I don't know the, you see, I don't know this office shit. You know, this is not for me. Um, he went to, I right, so he went on his honeymoon. And I said to myself, I said, why not get an accountant? Now, one of my best friends, uh, he was an accountant and he, he decided to quit because, you know, he was doing online. He's still doing online schooling. Uh, I don't know for what. Chris, don't kill me. But, uh, you know, we hired him. And, you know, he pretty much took it to the next, took it to the next level. You know, there's so much things that we don't know about. And Chris literally just, you know, he came, he fixed it. And, you know, he's the man. And uh, thank God we have Chris. So now it's three of us, me, Emil, and Chris. And things is going good. Things are going great. Um, going to these network events. Basically, whoever knows whoever knows about starting a startup or real estate, basically take it to the try to take it to the next level, and um, we've done that. And the whole coronavirus, everything just went slow um, with every business. But thank God, um, we're still getting jobs right now at the moment, and. It's it's crazy how a virus could really ruin people's lives, you know. Uh, you know, thank God, you know, God blessed me with amazing people around me. And, and you know, if someone want money, you know, I'm not going to act like I'm a millionaire or even there. Nowhere near of it. Nowhere near of it. But, you know, within three to four months, the company got our own office space. We've got a company's car. Um, yeah, I mean, we actually hired somebody new. Um, she's a sales manager. Um, and she's doing great. Uh, so we're pretty much expanding New York, Jersey, and Philly area. Um, and Dominique, shout out to Dominique. Uh, she's doing amazing, excellent. And, um, you know, I kind of want to, to, to pretty much give an, an induction to us and the company and maybe inspire inspire my words are all mixed up <laughs> inspire other people um you know this journey so far that i'm in it's literally just was luck right timing and belief and god willing you know we're gonna keep growing but the true reason why i wanted to start this blog is just seeing where things could go you know people say you know don't be a dreamer no i am a dreamer the only difference is you gotta make your dreams into reality right and people think it's easy i'm not gonna get a little you know i'm not gonna, i'm not going to get personal about me because it's not about me it's about inspiring and helping other people and it's about the company journey and adventure as a whole so anyways that's all in a nutshell and hopefully this gives everybody uh an idea how to start a company or, or whatever it is just believe in yourself and um you know we're gonna make a couple more videos and see how that goes and just want to talk about the market talk about um Crazy stories with contractors, crazy stories with clients, crazy stories with the market. And yeah, that's it for me. Um, everyone be safe, clean your hands. See you next video.